What is a 360 deal, multiple rights deal, in the music industry? As the music business evolved from eight tracks and records to compact discs and digital downloads, record companies had to evolve their business model to make money off the changes in technology. Physical sales of music are getting lower every year, and digital streaming and downloads are increasing rapidly. This was an alarm for record companies to change the working model to survive the transition. The record label's answer to the new digital age in music is the 360 deal. 360 deals are contracts that allow the record label to receive a percentage of the earnings from all of the artist's activities, rather than just earnings from record sales. 360 deals, also called multiple rights deals, are contracts where the record labels earn a percentage of the artist's ancillary rights. These rights may be the earnings made from concert revenue, merchandise sales, digital sales, streaming royalties, licensing, endorsement deals, and any other income stream you may think of. In exchange for receiving a larger percentage of the money made by the artists they represent, the labels take a lower cut from music sales. The labels also say they will commit to promoting the artists for a longer period and aggressively develop new opportunities for them. Essentially, the labels now often seek to serve as a manager and look after the artist's entire career rather than focusing only on selling the music. The 360 deal potentially solves some of the revenue problems of the record label. But what about the artist? For a new artist, the 360 deal is like a double-edged sword. Almost any artist would love to be signed to a major record label. But if he must include the label in any additional income he makes, the artist may be putting more money in the label's pockets than in their own bank accounts. The artist needs to be aware that he is giving his signature in exchange for a promise from the record label. And then, if you look at the success of pop artist Lady Gaga, who is an artist with a 360 deal, she may not have been such a success without the label's involvement in her career. So, if you are offered a 360 deal, get an experienced entertainment lawyer to explain every obligation you will have after signing. We will be pointing out more pros and cons of this deal in our future videos. Check the links in the description and hit the subscribe button if you'd like to receive notifications of new videos. We would love to hear about your experiences with 360 contracts in the comments section.